The city of Las Vegas and the Animal Welfare Coalition of Northeastern New Mexico have now cut ties, leaving the shelter there completely empty and a lot of the animals needing a place to go. News 13's Madison Connor tells us why the coalition didn't renew their contract. The city came to us and asked us if we could help run if we could help run the shelter. For over nine years now, Marshall Poole and the Animal Welfare Coalition of Northeastern New Mexico worked hand in hand with the city of Las Vegas, running their animal shelter as best as they could. But all of that changed this year. They've never talked to us specifically about this. In early January, Poole and his team started submitting these letters to the city clearly stating what they needed moving forward and asking to set up a time to chat about their upcoming contract renewal. Bringing up issues for the city that really we needed addressed before we could be comfortable making another renewal of the contract. Poole says those issues included the lack of animal control and no enforcement of pet ordinances in the city. Ninety percent of the animals in the city, um, we think, do not have rabies vaccine. But instead, in early May, the city released a request for proposals looking for another agency to run the shelter, just under two months away from the contract end date. Frankly, the city ought to be ashamed of this document. In that, the city laid out what they wanted. For example, is control over euthanasia. Um, and that we have to affirm under penalty of perjury that the offerer shall strictly adhere to the city's euthanasia and cremation directives. For that reason, among others, the coalition decided they couldn't in good conscience agree to the terms. This year, they're saying shelter operating costs, the operating costs for the shelter shall be the sole responsibility of the offerer. So they're even not offering to pay us anything to run the shelter. Over the course of two months, the coalition had to figure out what to do with the animals at the shelter. We've placed and transferred all the dogs that were in our care and all the cats that were in our care. The animals were spread out between shelters here in New Mexico and in Colorado. As of Friday, June 30th, it is now completely empty. We could not make a proposal. Nobody made a proposal. Leaving Las Vegas without animal care from the city. What is this city's plan for animals that are injured or ill? Madison Connor, KRQE News 13. We reached out to the city for comment. We were told they were busy and to call back after the holiday.